31 Valentine's Day edition of Toy Punks. Lego number 402702018 Bumblebee. And we've got the picnic, the great picnic of 2017. Lego set number 40236. It's going to be sweet. We've also got music by Dirty Fences from New York. Check them out on Spotify. Goodbye Love is the name of the album. Perfect for Valentine's Day. Goodbye Love. Can't. There's nothing more I need to say about that. We've got a great setup for you guys. And enjoy. Screw the chocolates. You don't need the chocolates. You don't need the roses. Come chill out. Watch some Toy Punks with us. We are Toy Punks. Oi. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, this is Toy Punks, Toy, P-U-N-K-S. My name is Jordan, and welcome back to the Valentine's Day edition of Toy Punks. Yes, a Valentine's Day edition, because this is what you do when you got a YouTube channel. You make cheesy holiday episodes for every holiday coming up. Not my favorite holiday, but hey, if you like eating chalk-flavored hearts and that's your thing, cool, man, I'm not going to hate it. So we got, I uh, hope you guys like also the background displays. Our budget's huge for this, as you guys can see. Pretty cool. So let's move on. So we got Legos. Everybody loves Lego, whether you're in a relationship or not. Who does not like building Legos? So we've got a couple for you today, too. We've got last year's uh, Valentine's holiday set, which they were doing the minifigure kind of displays with the little scene in the background for 2017 I believe and we did a couple of those you guys saw we did some Halloween ones we'll put some links up for the other Lego videos of the holiday sets and then we've got the 2018 set here so this is back to 2017 we got 40236 and for the 2018 set we got 40270 so this is going to be the holiday sets I believe for 2018 they're doing brick heads this year. Um, like I said before, uh, last year they did the minifigure scenery sets. And the year before that, before they had brick heads, they did something kind of similar where it was like kind of a build a character kind of thing. They did like a Santa. They had a couple different ones. So yeah, I guess this year they're doing brick heads. So let's look at the box. Um, let's look at the back real quick, actually, while I'm discussing that. Um, you guys can see like this shows the rest of the holiday sets that we're going to be getting this 2018 as Brickheads. So we got an Easter one coming up. We have a witch for Halloween, turkey for Thanksgiving, Santa for Christmas, and a Mrs. Claus for Christmas as well. So yeah, you guys can check that out. I'm not sure what is going on. Oh, okay, I see. Uh, it's just kind of showing, I guess, the accessories that come with the set. So you guys can see that. That must be a base, maybe. We'll see when we crack it open. Um, side, basic Lego stuff, basic Lego stuff. Little picture of what we get here. And then the front, you got the set number 40270, 140 pieces. And yeah, I kind of did that a little bit backwards, but whatever. You guys, you guys get the idea. So let's check it out. Um, and then we got this box uh, scene, which I always like these minifigure scenes a little bit better. I think it's cool. I like getting the minifigures in the little pieces just, you know, so you can use them with the other sets. And I just prefer these better. So this is from last year. Um, pretty similar to how all those sets usually have the little icon there with the name tag. I guess you could write this uh, out for somebody if you want to give this. Or, you know, even give it away as a valentine. It makes a nice little cute little valentine's gift. Actually, coincidentally, not even joking, my girlfriend got me these. And thought it would be a good idea for us to uh, do them for toy puns. Even though it wasn't a uh, Valentine's Day gift. We don't really do that. But this is her idea. So yeah. So I'm stuck here doing a Valentine's Day video for you guys. So the back. Let's check it out. We have a cool scene. This is actually pretty sweet. I like how it looks like it's going to be a heart for the base plate. Um, shows you kind of a picnic ordeal going on. This dude's got all this stuff. He's like, oh, this is crazy. And she's like, oh, I love you. And they're on a nice little picnic. And yeah, basic box. 40236, that's it. So let's do a quick build. We're gonna do them one by one. Um, maybe we will do, let's start with this one first. So let's do it. Toy Punks, boy.
right, we're done, everyone. And uh, I have to say, like a Cupid's arrow, this uh, this set's pretty straight. I like it. It's pretty cool so far. Honestly, I don't. I, in all seriousness, though, I do like this set. I think it's cool. It's got a lot of little features, a lot of cool little details to it. Um, it was fun little build, easy little build. And it was pretty clever. Um, the first part of it was this fountain. I thought it was pretty sweet how they uh, used the pieces there to build this fountain and to make the water look like it's kind of cascading out and shooting over. So that's kind of a cool little side piece. Um, colorful too. Uh, you guys can see the little pieces right there that were left over after the build. Um, we'll go out over that when I'm done. So yeah, then moving on, we did, I believe it was maybe this piece, which is kind of cool, just like a flower pot with some flowers. And that was a cool little micro fun build too. I like how they use all these tiny pieces to make little uh, scenes. Um, and then this was sweet too. I really liked the sandwiches for the picnic. Thought it was uh, awesome. It looks nice. And then, you know, it's kind of got two different color breads right there maybe a rye who knows but uh looks pretty sweet i think it looks great and then this was cool piece as well um i just i'm just a sucker for like these like little mini kind of accessories too these can be used for all different sets um so it's always nice to have little tiny little lego pieces and accessories and then um going on to picnic blanket itself that was pretty cool. You get a little bear, um, some treats right there, a pineapple, which is kind of weird, a uh, balloon, which I could see this being used for like a custom, maybe it, Pennywise, be perfect for that. So that's pretty sweet piece there. Um, and then the tree, I thought was pretty clever too, how they used that with the little bird house and you have a little bird. Um, just out of some one stud pieces. I like those tiny little builds. I think they're cool. Some flowers on the end. Some nice detail there. So I think it was pretty dope. Uh, overall, the, the figures, the minifigures themselves, we'll go over that real quick. So yeah, let's check this guy out. We got a little ho a hoodie, a star on there, blue hoodie, some blue pants. Yeah, pretty average looking dude. So that's cool. This back here. So he looks cool, and then she looks a little bit better, I think. Just because he got the sunglasses. And you can see maybe uh, some chocolate bars there, and. guy carries this letter which would be I'm assuming some type of love letter who knows so yeah that's the mini figs and overall I think what's pretty cool about this set too if you guys noticed is If you put all the pieces together, it makes a heart, which is kind of a cool little feature. They all fit like perfectly together. We have pieces on the side there, maybe. More flowers there. Pretty sweet little set. I like these little scene sets and I like the minifigures. It's cool. You got you got a lot of accessories. So that's what I think about that. So let's do it and let's go to the next 2018 set. We got 40270 coming up. This weird B. Let's check it out. Toy Punks. Or right.
Welcome back, it's Built, and what is the buzz with this B? Honestly, I do not get it, really. I, I never really knew that bees were a part of Valentine's Day, honestly. Um, so, to be honest with you, I've gotten a couple of these brick heads. Oh, and let me, um, let me just say something real quick. I noticed before I started the video, I did mess up this wing, so I had to redo that real quick. I just had to, uh, these two pieces switched around. But, um... This is the first brick head I've built. I have a couple other ones. I have all the Batman ones. I just haven't built those. Um, and I'm not gonna hate on it, honestly. I, it's, it looks a lot cooler in person. Um, I've got a couple flower Lego uh, sets that came out. Little, I think they might have been little promo like sets for springtime or something. So I think they'll look cool next to it. Uh, that this will look cool next to it. Um, it looks like a bee. I don't think it has anything to do with Valentine's Day, but um, I don't know, he's holding a heart. It's a cool little build. It was kind of interesting how they did the head with the uh, uh, rounded pieces here. Um, it doesn't look too bad. Honestly, it's got, it would have been cool to see something maybe better with the wings, but I think it looks pretty cool. A little stinger on the back. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure what this is. This is kind of weird. I think it could be maybe a honeycomb, or maybe you could put some flowers, there's some flowers in here, maybe you could put those flowers in there and you could hold some flowers, kind of looks like a pipe, it's weird, I'm not really sure what's going on with that, so that's kind of different, but I do say, uh, one thing that I did like about this though, honestly, is the stand, the stand is pretty cool, I like the tile right here, it says seasonal, and uh, I, I'm not sure if they, all the seasonal sets will look like this. This, I mean, it kind of looks like the B, I guess. So that's kind of cool. It's a seasonal there. So if you collect all of the seasonal sets, they will. They should look nice together. And this is a, a nice little stand. Um, you can set them on here to display them on. So going over the stand itself here, you guys saw in the build. Um, this is kind of a little weird to put on. It's just time consuming and it's kind of hard to get those little pieces on there but uh, I like these uh, leaf pieces those are cool um, and if you guys can see here's a couple extra pieces we didn't get any extra leaf pieces um, also if you guys notice at the end of the video too I know it's uh, sped up so you probably can't really tell but um, it was weird because I thought it was done the figure was done and then uh, they brought in the sunflower builds and they look cool they're cool little builds um, and I guess it kind of just gives you the option to place, replace these. So I'm not sure what's going on. I guess you just take off the roses if you want. You can replace them there. Um, so I'll, I'll take some photos of both uh, pictures with the sunflowers and with the roses next to them. So, I mean, that's pretty cool that they let you customize that too. Um, I, I like the sunflowers. I think they look great. And uh, these are some nice pieces. The overall set, I think it just looks cool. Um, it's very bright and colorful. It looks nice. Not a huge fan of the brake heads, but this is cool. And um, not sure why they went with the B for Valentine's Day. But let's check it out uh, compared to the other set side by side. See them together. And uh, see what you guys think. So let's bring that in. Both sets side by side together last year's set this year's set of 2018 what do you guys think you think um which one do you do you prefer i honestly i kind of like this set better um let me get this in shot here yeah i don't know there's a lot of little details here i think it'd be cool too i mean there's more play features um it looks cooler and then it i mean it just looks i like the whole idea that it, it's a heart too um, when you put it together, that's cool. It's got more of a Valentine's Day vibe. Couple, you know, going out for a picnic. It's nice. It's nice. Um, the box, too. I like that, too. How you can, uh, oh, it's got the label on there. And then we have the brick head over here. And I know they've been doing a lot with these brick heads in. It's a nice looking brick head. It does look good. Uh, very bright colors. I think it looks great. I'm not going to knock it. Um, I like that tile uh, for the stand there I think it looks cool um, in the video I 
had forgotten about these builds here. I didn't realize that there was more to build, so you can swap these in and out. So that's kind of nice to switch things up a bit, maybe kind of get... It, it kind of does too, you know, you got the Valentine's Day thing with the roses, or maybe you can swap this in and out for us uh, around springtime. You got some options there. So I think overall, they're both cool sets, and I'm excited to see how these other brick heads for the seasonal line are going to go. Uh, it'll be fun to make those those videos for you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. Some cool Valentine's Day sets, guys, and some cool music for you, which I think was fitting. We've got the Dirty Fences from New York. Rock and roll, punk rock kind of band. I like them a lot. The album's called Goodbye Love. Perfect for Valentine's Day. And um, I like them. They've got kind of a vibrators kind of vibe to it to me i don't know check them out listen to them on spotify and not to get all cheesy happy valentine's day but from the bottom of our hearts thank you guys for watching and tuning in because you're what keeps us making this show so thank you guys so much once again we are toy punks like subscribe hit that notification bell hit us up and we'll see you next time we are toy punks oi